Hi, I'm Tim Carter, and I'm the proud owner of three different Volvos, and I've had them for years, and I love Volvos, and I want to show you right now how to adjust the headlights on your Volvo S60, and I have a 2007 model. Take a look at this. All right, so here is the headlight assembly. It's, you know, it's a completely sealed unit, and I'm going to show you exactly how to adjust, you know, the up and down for that Xenon headlight. Oh, but wait, I forgot something. I'm also the Ask the Builder guy. Now, look, I've worked on my cars and trucks for years, and I've saved a lot of money. But I'm, I'm the Ask the Builder guy. If you go to AskTheBuilder.com, that's who I really am. And I can save you a boatload of money each week if you just sign up for my free newsletter at AskTheBuilder.com. I'm going to give you all kinds of great tips there that show you how to save money on your house. Now, let's go save some money on your car right now so you don't have to give it to the Volvo dealer or your regular car auto repair guy. Check this out. All right, back to the headlight. So, you know, I've got the hood open, and you can see, um, you know, this this is in the way. But if you just kind of go right back here and look at this. All right, see this right here? This is a uh, assembly, and this little screw right here, it's a hex head. It's a quarter-inch hex head with this big, flat washer head. All you have to do is rotate that with a nut driver and your headlights are going to go up or down depending on which way you turn it. It's really, really simple. Just make sure you mark out on the um, on a garage door, you know, park on a level spot, make a mark where the center of the headlight beam is, and then go ahead and start to adjust it up or down and then go out and check it. All right, you already know if you would have taken that into a Volvo dealer, you might have gotten charged 50 bucks, you know, to uh, learn how that how to, how to do that. And, and you know, you would invest in an hour time. It's just crazy. It's something that you can do in just seconds. So I hope that tip helped you, and uh, be safe when you're driving. I'm Tim Carter, the Ask the Builder Guy.